Hello, co-creators. Hello, Tauruses. Gods, goddesses, and angels of the light. Higher self source to see someone's ancestors, guides, calling. Tauruses, higher self and guides, please give us a clear message. Show us what Taurus needs to see. Taurus's higher self and guides, please show us what Taurus needs to see. Take this as a sign if you found this. This message is for you. You can look up your sun, moon, and rising as well to get more personalized messages. Remember, nothing is ever set in stone. Either just take what, take what resonates and leave the rest. Let's get it. Let's go. Show us what Taurus needs to see, please. Show us what Taurus needs to see. A clear message, please. Show us. Two, see. some cards on the bottom of the deck that is what that is the overall message for Taurus success recognition enthusiasm ultimate happiness joy inner peace Nice. Okay, Taurus. Let's get it. Let's go. Let's see what we have in common here. You're going through a few things. Whoa, we've got one, two, three, four. Four major events going on, Taurus. Okay. Four categories of life. Um, we're looking at, oh goodness, what else do we have in common here? You are really balanced. You have a combination of earth, fire, um, air, and water equally and equal amount, <clears throat> an equal amount of of um, major arcanas. That is, wow. Okay, so Taurus, what I'm seeing here. For your central issues, your guides want you to see um, having more control over your money um, saving, being, um, extravagance, having extravagance in your world, uh, but being mindful of your spending, um, just controlling your finances right now, you know, don't be overspending, 
this is essential issue. I see Ace of Fire. So I'm seeing um, opportunities, creativity, action. You're taking active steps towards that. But I'm also seeing here crossing these issues. I'm seeing eight of air, self-doubt, confusion, free will. Maybe you are having some self-doubt because you are needing some introspection right now. Maybe you are okay. So Taurus opportunity. There's an opportunity. You have creativity and action, extravagance, control. You're being controlling with your money right now. And there's an opportunity here, be it um, opportunity for truth, opportunity for, let's see what the opportunity is. I'm gonna pull, let's dig, let's dig deeper, Taurus, okay? Okay, okay. <laughs> Let's see, what cards do I want to use? I'll use these ones. Okay, so what opportunity, Spirit, higher self and guides of Taurus, God's God, 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 God. show us for the Ace of Fire, please. Show us diving deep, please. Can we get more clarity for Taurus? What opportunities in creativity Creative action. Jumping cards are good. Whoa, okay. No joke. Okay, Ace of Fire. Show us more, please. Show us what we need to see. Okay, planted seeds. Something that you've planted seeds, waiting for harvest. You're waiting um, for your more abundance to come in. You're, you've been. Whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry. I don't know why I'm apologizing. <laughs> Not my fault that they jumped out of my hand, right? Okay. Just one more time. Show this quick. You need to see. Become aware of fears, which makes sense because what's crossing this is self-doubt and confusion. But we're trying to see here, Spirit, please give us a clear message. What creative opportunities does Taurus need to see? Queen of Coins, wealth in all areas and shares. Okay, um, there is a queen energy around you, okay? You have an opportunity to be with a queen of coins, queen of pentacles, somebody that, you know, uh, is very abundant and shares. You, uh, you have an opportunity in, I'm gonna assume in love, or friendship with somebody and you're confused you must be confused about two women here because it's showing a woman here a brunette and a blonde um, be it um, if this is a male or, or a female watching you know take it how it resonates so if this is a Taurus female watching it is a brunette or a, a blonde 
you know, a male. But if it is a male watching Taurus, this is a brunette, a brunette female or a brunette blonde. I mean, a blonde female or a brunette. You get the picture. Okay. So um, that's what I'm seeing. You have opportunity in uh, with these, between these two people in your life, whatever sex it is. I don't know your life. And um, you have some self-doubt, some confusion, um, but you also have free will, okay? To make that decision between the two. But you are confused, but um, you know, maybe you want your cake and eat it too, Taurus. Maybe, um, what is the self-doubt? What is this self-doubt about? Please show us what we need to see. Show us what we need to see. Okay, maybe your self-doubt and confusion is because, oh, you need to balance your emotions and have more self-control. Um, okay, there is some moving, it's a moving energy. Maybe one of them wants to move in. Um, enthusiasm, creative activities so somebody is very enthusiastic the self-doubt confusion free will okay nine of wands this is so confusing the, your energy is so confused taurus nine of wands you have built something with one of them um maybe both of them i'm seeing um a youthful dreamer, um, you're stuck in no action, Taurus. I'm seeing you're looking at the world of there's spilt milk right now. Like you don't see what you do have. You're only seeing what you've lost. Um, also temperance is like a healing energy. So maybe you're trying to heal from one of these connections. Um, also I'm seeing moving on. So maybe one is about to move on from the relationship Taurus and you, because you're not making a decision, I'm also seeing a spiritual knowledge or maybe it's some sexy, uh, uh, mentor that you have, or maybe one of them is a sexy mentor or maybe you just need to seek out more spiritual knowledge. Um, also, maybe you have a broken heart from one of them that is still mending and healing. So that is why you are having so much self-doubt and confusion and you know that you have free will, but you're not making any decisions. That's what I'm seeing, Taurus. This is, wow, some really confusing energy. Um, let's move on. So I see the hermit here. Uh, this is your subconscious uh, message from your subconscious or what lies below. So it's a secret from yourself that you are not aware of. So it is either, yeah. So you're, what I'm seeing here uh, as the hermit, okay. I'm seeing that introspection, self-discovery, mentorship, um, going inward, being enlightened, okay. That is what I'm seeing. You need to have more self-discovery so you can make these decisions These uh, between these two. Um, you need to uh, maybe seek out a mentor. Um, maybe you uh, need to dive deeper into self-reflection, like really taking some time alone to know yourself and figure out what it is that Taurus wants. What do you want, Taurus? Who are you, Taurus? What would make you happy? Okay, then we have here the moon card as your past position. So maybe there was some secrets, some illusions. Maybe um, you were very intuitive about something. You had a revelation. Um, maybe it's based towards these relationships you were in 
or maybe they the one of those females um, was holding some secrets from you that came to light in your past or males if this is a female watching sorry um conscious desire i'm seeing seven of waters you have a lot of choices and you know that and you're weighing out all your options right now your conscious desire is that you know, you could have A, B, C, D, you know, one, two, three, and all of them, uh, you are choices overanalyzing and you're procrastinating at making this decision. That is what I'm seeing. And King of Fire is your immediate desire. Um, I'm sorry, your immediate focus. And I'm seeing king energy. I'm seeing inspirational, charismatic, innovative. You're trying to figure things out. That is your conscious desire. And um, I'm, I'm sorry, your immediate focus. This is your immediate focus card. Um, yes. And um, it's king energy. So um, your self card is the queen of fire. So we've got the king and the queen of fire here. That's the queen of wands, the king of wands. In the traditional tarot, I'm seeing intelligent, exuberant, determined, but I am seeing those two on the de on the on the spread here, and that usually tells me that this is energy of passion and um, uh, somebody that doesn't really settle down. Um, they do, but they're kind of in and out energy. Um, that's just what I'm seeing. Okay, so two of air is how the world views you, indecision, avoidance, and confusion. You're confusing the people around you or they just see you as a confused person or the people around you are confused. Okay, um, transformation. This is your hopes and fears. You're hoping for change, a life change, liberation, realization, and you know, at the same time, you're not, you're, it's, it's a fear. So you're hoping for that and it's a fear, but I, I said it, didn't mean to, but I said it next to the sun card here. So you are going to have, you know, uh, ultimate happiness and success from a transformation, from making a decision, from having a life change, okay? And the emperor, that's your ultimate, that's your outcome. Your outcome is organized. Your outcome is leadership. Your outcome is structured. Somebody that owns their own company, somebody that runs their own stuff. They're the manager, they're their own boss. They're just the ultimate male energy. That is what I got for you, Taurus. I hope you enjoyed your reading. And three weeks from now, you are going to be in emperor energy. So I'm going to assume you will be making that decision and you will be very clear on it. Um, please like, share, and subscribe so you can get post um, updated when I uh, post new videos. And bye for now.